Salutations and good morrow, everyone, and welcome back to Hydroneer. We are picking up where we left off, actually a little bit afterwards, in our 2.0 launch of Hydroneer, and I'm really excited to say that I just dumped a whole bunch of really... Okay, good. Oh, oh I was so worried there for a moment. This Clotmium, or Clotium, or whatever it is, is worth a ton of money, and I thought I just dumped it out and lost it, so I was going to be really bummed out there for a second, but let me show you guys what I mean by a ton of money. When I go up here and sell this tiny little bar that I just made that has three pieces in it, if this was gold, this would sell for like a hundred little gold pieces. This thing's selling for over a thousand already, so I'm just going to go ahead and sell that guy right away here, because my plan is to go through and buy a couple things today and work on unlocking that large mine thing that was like 7,000. I want to see if that's an actual mine that I can go in because if I look at the map here, if I can get in here and look at a map, uh, yeah, just look at this map here for a second. If we look, that definitely looks like an area you can dig right there in Ice Helm, so that's what I want. So I want to get over there. And then also, right here inside of Bridgeport, there's a place to sell. Right outside in here, there's a place to sell, uh, I think that's gems. So I really want to get this area right here. I want to get a Ice Helm for my place to sell. Now, or my place to mine, I should say. Now, right now, I have 1,800 monies. And I actually need to go over to Bridgeport really quick to pick something up. Because, well, I may have made a little mine automation over here that looks really great, right? It looks really like it's working really well, except for I put down my thing and it didn't work very well. Oh, yeah, I, I, I made a little bit of a whoopsie here. I, I put down my crucible to catch all of that, and let's just say it didn't work very well. So, now I got a big old mess I gotta clean up. And yeah, so I got to do that. So that's what we're going to do today. I'm going to get this mess cleaned up. We are going to make a super huge sword because I have two large iron ingots here already ready for me to go. So I need just one more and I want to make it so we can get out some large stuff here. Now I could go through and just pick these up manually, but that sounds like a huge pain in the butt. And I'm not in for huge pains in the butt at this time in the morning. So let's go ahead and let's just grab our awesome uh, little guy here. A little car and let's get to it shall we beep 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 i wish this had a beeping sound but i know that probably would have driven some people insane i bet you at some point it did have a beeping sound i just missed it hmm. that's all right all right let's go on over to bridgeport now i got a little bit better at driving not a lot better but a little bit better at driving so i can handle this guy eh, just slightly better now, there's another place to sell that's, like, right over here that I forget about all the time. I think they want gold bars there. But, anyway. Alright, so here we are inside of Bridgeport. Let's just go ahead and hop out of our good old car here. Make sure it's stopped this time. Or, for the most part, stopped. There it is. There it is. That's what I'm looking for right there. A magnet on a stick. So, here, let's throw this in there. I'm gonna go ahead and grab me one of these magnets on a stick here. I toss it down. All right, that's kind of expensive, but I expected that. All right, what else? A uh, magnifying glass, displays durability of items. No, I don't think I need that at the moment. I probably should get it, but I don't need it. I already have a small furnace. Logic compressor, compresses gemstones. I don't have enough for that. Ooh, a standing torch, maybe. Use to flatten out terrain. Oh, that would probably be just wonderful. Hand sorter. Or resources into the sorter to split out into a different resource type. That actually might be super handy. I'm going to grab one of those. I know that this is something that's brand new to this update. So I'm going to go ahead and grab one of these. Uh, because if I can hand sort out or like this thing sorts out all of the different uh, materials that I need. So that way I can just sort the, I, the like the gold out or the iron out for say if I can get all the iron out then I can continuously produce tools and or weapons I should say and make that much more money so I'm gonna do that now I'm gonna grab my little magnet on a stick here attracts resources when activated I don't know how you activate a magnet on a stick I'm assuming it's just clicking like everything else Ooh, my money my money I need to grab my money I need to become Mr. Krabs here all right, let's go. Now that we have our good old little pile of money, let's get back home, shall we? I'm sure that absolutely nothing is going to go wrong on the way home. 
Yeah, see that? That right there. That That's the little storage place that I was telling about that the buy stuff. I'm thinking that's probably for like the tower or the little town that's right over there or something. But I'm hoping that something gets added there. Honey, I'm home. Let's try not to destroy anything on the way here. Come, oh, out, out, out. All right, perfect. So we're home. All right, let's grab our magnet stick. Yeah. All right. Now, if I remember correctly, the way that this thing is supposed to work. Yes. See? This is what I'm talking about. All right. So then if I take the... Oh, God, I picked up my tools. Oh, my God, I'm picking up everything. Uh, um, okay, just, just drop it. Just drop it. Okay. Grab my tools and put these somewhere far else. It's not really far away, but hey, what's this? Oh, that's my, uh, I made one. <laughs> I was like, I have another power uh, stem, power shard stone? Power shard ingot? I guess it could be called. But, um, okay, now that we got that done, let's go, let's just go ahead and throw these items in here really quick. If I get all the gold taken out, then all of the... Iron will be no problem at all to pick up with the magnet tool. And hopefully they'll all just go into the crucible without a problem. Get all this gold in here. Oops, that's how you throw gold right on the floor. All right, let me get this cleaned up. I don't like to have you guys just sit here and watch me clean up a mess. I don't know if this thing makes more of a mess or, or helps out more. Oh my God, I'm just trying to clean up all these little like rock pieces that I have all over the place now. Cause like I have a bunch of them down here, right? Because this is from my like previous trying to do a, like a little bit of automation for myself. I had like the rock mo sorter up here and stuff, trying to do stuff here. Let's just set these down on this conveyor belt, shall we? Okay, perfect. That's gonna work. That that's This is probably gonna make just an absolute mess once it goes through, but I'm okay with it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over and I'm gonna turn this on after I put a crucible down. Let me uh, let me just drop this guy up here. We're get, it's gonna start getting dark too. Oh, come on, there it goes. It's gonna start getting dark here soon too. So I haven't cleaned up this mess yet. That's all my gold. Where's my other crucible? Here's my crucible that's just got a couple things in it. So let me just uh, dump everything. Can I get this to pull things out of here? Does that, does that do that? I think it does do that. Here, let's try to just lift it out. And then just set it on the... Oh! I pulled it out of the gold crucible too. Oh, I'm trash, but whatever. Okay. Yeet! Goodbye. Okay, I know it's super dark. I'm sorry. Let me get, let me get some, let me get some lights over here. I think I could get some lights over here that's gonna make this look that much better. Where'd I put that stinky hat of mine? I had a hat. It wasn't the best hat in the world, but I had it and it was mine. I had a hat. Here, let me let me let me get let me get a couple of these. Let me let me just get a couple of that. Hopefully that doesn't light your building on fire. My bad. My bad, dude. Um I hope you have insurance, because I'm gonna go ahead and say not my fault. Hope you're all right with that. All right, here, let's throw a little bit more of our money in just so we can light things up because I hate how dark it is. It gets so dark in this game so quickly. Here, press the button, pick up the torch, bring it over here. We now have light, right? You're gonna give off a good amount of light, right? Not, not even, Oh, there it goes. Okay, I was gonna say, if that's all the light that you're giving off, I'm gonna be super sad. But no, that actually is not a- that's not a bad amount of light at all. You just have to turn it on. I was hoping that, uh, it would just work automatically, but you actually gotta turn it on, which is not a big deal. Okay. Let's put this guy down here. Um, I'm just gonna kind of place it in the wall, I guess. Yeah, that's at least a little bit better, right? Yeah, that's better. Okay, let's go turn this machine on. And then we'll clean up our mess again. And then, where's my hat? I know I had the hat. There it is. We put my hat on. Yeah! Hat! It's not super bright, but it works. Alright, so this is now running. That's running a ton of stuff through the grinder. Let me guess. It just made it... Oh no, it's working. Oh, it's wor okay. It worked a little bit there. It worked for the most part. I think that there might be a, a piece of gold or something stuck in there, but that's okay. That just worked like a treat. Oh, that was gorgeous. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Let me pick this guy up. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that. Hold on. Hold, hold on. 
Hold on, stop making a mess. Don't make a mess. <laughs> I'm making a mess! Okay. Alright, are we good? Oh, look, we got some gemstones too. Nice! Okay. Alright, so we did make a huge mess. That's good. So this is just gold. So I'm just gonna go set this over here, because I know that that's just gold. Alright. Then, how do I want to do this? I think I need to take everything out of here. So let me... Oh my. Okay. Uh... This tool bag is starting to get on my nerves. So just go all the way over here. Alright? I'm just trying to... <laughs> I'm just trying not to have made a huge mess. I sent everything flying. Are we, are we holding together? At least a little bit where what's going on okay so i gotta drag it all right i gotta i gotta drag it and i can't go at full speed all right just just bring it over make a pile make a pile and we'll clean it up just 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 make a pile and we'll clean it up oh there's a cloud beam in there nice or cloud team or whatever it is let me grab that that's expensive let me let me just go put that in the expensive pile this is the expensive pile you go right there Oh my god, I made such a huge mess. Look at this! Look at this! Ah! Oh my lord. Okay. We're gonna do some magic. Three, two, one. There. Okay. Clean. That only took like 15 minutes for me to go through and clean all that up. But we now have a nice organized area. There's just a couple more quick things that I need to grab from down here. Uh, mostly gems. Uh, the gems are really because you can't smelt them so they don't fit into the crucible. So they just fall underneath it. Uh, so, you know, you just got to get yourself some gems here. I'm just going to make a little pile over here. I'm literally, you know, going to build Erebor's treasure hold by the time I'm done with this. But so far, I'm super excited to get to that mine. I can tell you guys that. Like, I'm super, super excited to get in there to make that that mine mine inside of ice helm because you know who doesn't want to have a dwarf stronghold as their mine right who doesn't want that in a game so um i've already went through i've already started warming up a couple ingots i know that uh, these are just kind of in here for show right now let's grab our big old iron bucket here and i'm gonna dump oop, i'm gonna dump this guy on here there we go Perfect, and then we're gonna make a big old ring, and then we're gonna sell both of those, and hopefully it's enough to buy that mine. I need 7,000 coins though, so I think they're called hydro coins. So I need 7,000 hydro coins in order to actually make this. So, oh, it's gonna be tight, because I only have like a thousand, I think, right now. So I literally need to make 6,000 on one big sword. Which is possible. Yeah, I only have a thousand Hydro Coins right now. It's possible. It's not impossible. Uh, but if it's not, if it's not going to happen, then we're going to make another big weapon. And we're going to try to sell that one. Because we have the technology now to set up to let this guy run and to collect all the different resources from it to allow us to make a bunch of money. But it sounds like our iron is done. Oh, that's a full crucible. All right, pour it on in there. All right. Which I'm going to take this guy. I'm just going to drop it on down here because I don't think that there's any more gems down here. So that's fine. I'm just going to drop you like right there. Nope, not not like that, like that. Nope, not like that, like that. Still not quite. Maybe just a little bit more. No, just kind of fit. Kind of just 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 gently. Just just gently. Get gently. I'm going to have to move all those rocks. Huh? Gone. Here, just go up there. Just, just go in there. Stop falling, right? Ah! No! You know what? You know, this is, this is actually gonna work out. This is, this is, this is gonna be fine. This is gonna be fine. You know why? Because I'm just gonna do this. All of you could go down in this hole that's underneath here. There's a hole here. It wasn't meant to be there, but it's there anyway. So we're gonna put you there. Take you. Drop you down here. Just go. Just, just go! It's not exactly where I want to. Just go! No, stop getting caught on that lip right there. Thank you, finally. Okay, uh, all right. Now, let's go turn this guy back on so that way it's just running in the background. There we go, that's gonna make everything run. Okay, good, good, good. And then we watch it go. <laughs> that's so awesome. Okay, now, time to craft big ol' sword. You go in there, you go in there. 
And you go in there. Gotta warm those up real quick. Getting our ingots nice and warmed up. Oh, look at that. Over there just making me money. You know what I want to try? I'm going to try this. I have another power shard bar. I'm going to open this guy up. I'm just going to drop this in here. Close this guy back up and see if it starts working faster. Looks like it's going a little bit faster. Maybe I need another one. I know that the, all the pipes don't help either. And I know I was going to get that sorter put in. We're going to get that all worked out here in just a second. Let's drop this down in here. So drop you. Ah. Uh, oh. Uh, just go over there for now. I've messed up. Oh, and now everything's failing. All right, grab my blacksmith hammer quickly. And then boom, boom, boom. Yes. Oh, I've made a huge sword. All right. I have crafted a giant sword. We are going to be using this to sell for a bunch of money right now. We're going to run over there. I don't even care. We're going to run. We're going to run. It doesn't make any sense, but we're running. All right, so running may have been a small mistake, but nonetheless, we are over here now. And what are we going to be able to sell this thing for? 91% of its value. It's worth 3,000. That's missing 9%. So it's probably worth 4,000 if I sell it at the regular jeweler. Back home! Okay, now that we've also run a whole nother mile over here, I'm actually just gonna set this up on the jeweler. I'm not quite gonna sell it right yet because what I want to do, oh yeah, see, 3,600 over here. Worth it, worth the run. Okay, what I want to do is I wanna go make a necklace first. I'm gonna go make a big old necklace and I'm gonna bring it back. I'm gonna sell that at the same time and we're gonna try to make enough money for us to go through and sell and make enough money to buy that that mine. I only need 2,000, maybe some more. No, about another three, yeah, about another 3,000 from a necklace. So I gotta melt down all this gold so that way I can make part one of the necklace. I have some gems. I'm gonna use sapphire because I think those are worth the most. I think. Oh, you made a mess again. Oh, you made a mess again. All right, let me get this cleaned up. And then we're going to make our necklace and everything's going to be good. All right, we'll see you guys in a second. Okay, guys. So after almost an hour more of work and trying to get this to work and finding this super rare little gem right here. This is the first onyx I've found in the game. I think we are finally ready to make our our necklace here. This took me a long time. The game crashed three times. It's been a whole thing. So I think that we're finally ready to make this guy here, to make this big old necklace. So let's go ahead and get these pieces of metal over on the anvil. Grab my blacksmithing hammer and make one big old necklace. Ah, oh, there we go. All right, now the moment of truth. Is this necklace gonna be enough or am I gonna need to make one more thing? Which I have a very large metal ingot over there, an iron ingot that I'm going to use if this does not work to make a dagger that I know will put me over the top because this is gonna be pretty darn close with everything I've been checking. So right now this sword is worth 3,600 and now with this necklace, 8,390, yes! Okay, oh thank you. Oh, thank you. Let's go mix that with our money. And we're going to bring this over, guys. And we are going to go buy that mine. We are going to do that right now. This game almost beat me today, guys. But I wouldn't let it happen just for all of you guys. It's a big moment here in Hydraneer for me. I'm really happy about this. little over $9,000. Let's try not to crash the game on the way over. Ah, oh, here we go. Put that big old pile of money back there. Look at this. I even have... I'm sorry the game's went a little chugging a little bit. But I even have cups of gems now for everything that I found. There's even more down there. More iron here. This is a huge metal ingot. I, there's so much that I have done. Just trying to get up the gold to be able to make that one necklace. But I'm thankful, guys, that we are finally there. It looks like that we are finally on our way to go buy Icehelm, the mine that's there. And I hope... And I pray that this is worth it. So let's get on over there right now, guys. Oh, this is like the most successful feeling road trip I've ever taken. Oh God, please don't break on me now. Like after everything I've been through, this is like a super satisfying, like, yes, I'm driving over here. Yes, I did this. 
Yes, I am worthy of buying this mine. This took so long. And we're finally on our way to do it, so let's get up over here. Oh. I really hope that this is worth it. If this isn't worth it, I'm gonna be... I'm gonna be really, really bummed out, but I'm sure that it will be. There's no way that an area like what I just spent all that time grinding out for is not gonna be worth it. So here, let's stop our car. Perfect. Just, just go ahead and roll forward a little bit. I don't even care. Just give me my money. Okay, so where did I buy this thing again? Not there. It was downstairs is where it was. I hope there's not fall down. Oh, good. The, the elevator's here for me. See that? It knew I was coming to buy it. It even brought me an elevator. It was like, here you go, Sim. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. This is exactly what I want. Okay, let's go downstairs and let's buy this thing. Downstairs. Downstairs. Not not upstairs. Downstairs. Which I think that that's one of these directions. I don't even care. There's not fall damage. <laughs> We're just going for it. Let's just jump. Okay, let's see. It should be... Oh, watch out for that. That actually does kind of hurt, actually. I'm worried I might actually die doing that. Okay. For sale. 7,200. I was actually overcompensating. Buy that for me. Thank you. Now, what did I just buy? This is now running. So did I buy this area down here? Is that what I ended up buying? Is just this? I don't know. I, I think so. I think that this is what I bought. It didn't open up any doors or anything like that, and I doubt I can pump lava through things to make it work faster. But you guys bet that I'm going to be trying to pump lava through things to make it work. Because otherwise, I don't have any water down here. Oh yeah, I do. I have water right here. I bet you I can pump this water down over here. It's going to be hard. But I can do it. Oh, okay. All right, let's take this money over here to this other side. We have the, we have a little over, I think, 800 hydro coins left or something like that. Maybe a thousand. And there was a store that was over here. Right? Somewhere? I know that there's a store over here somewhere. So one's a way down, right? Yeah, and then over here is the store. Okay. All right, what do we got? We got buckets and pans and stuff. Let me just drop this money in here. I got 2,000. Okay. I could buy all those designs. We're going to do that a little bit later. Cloud me and water pipe. Pumps water into at 250% pressure. Okay, so all of these are really good. Okay, so we are going to do this, guys. But we are going to do this in the next episode, guys. We are ready. We bought a mine with a whole bunch of stuff. We took a ton of money. We took a lot of time and I'm all recorded out for right now. So we're going to go on and we in the next episode, guys, I'm going to be recording right after this one to see what we can mine up in this mine. For all we know, this could be a complete cloud me mine that could be a huge money pot for us. Who knows? I'm going to go over there. I'm going to grab up all of my stuff. I'm going to bring it back over here. We're going to start getting some automation going over here, guys. We're going to get some mining going. I'm going to do a little bit of testing and we'll be back here very, very soon. But guys, don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And as always, I'll see all of you guys in the next one.